A Detroit judge slams an ex-police officer who took the law into his own hands. Why he says he had no choice but to send him off to jail. And it tops our news at 5.30. Today, former St. Clair Shores police officer Michael Nor Notoriano was sentenced to six months in jail. That sentence is for his role in a violent confrontation with a group of Detroit men who stole his daughter's cell phone. Our Lauren Vidal was in court as the judge delivered a strong message along with a stiff sentence. Here's some background. A former St. Clair Shores police officer up against one misdemeanor charge here today at Frank Murphy after a jury found him not guilty of 10 other charges, including armed robbery and racial intimidation. He thought at sentencing, probation out the door. But that's not what the judge had in mind. I do deeply regret this incident. Ex St. Clair Shores police officer Mike Notoriano stood before Judge Kenny with an apology. There were no winners at all in this situation, um, not only uh, for myself and my family, but for, uh, for all of those involved. Every single thing he's done as a police officer uh, exemplifies uh, everything we want in a police officer. But this father, husband, and 20-year police veteran will now spend six months in the Wayne County Jail. Judge Kenny setting an example after 18 months probation was the prosecution's recommendation. That it be a deterrent to others who might think to act in that way. Earlier this year, a jury found Notoriano guilty of willful neglect of duty by a public official after he and a Detroit police sergeant, David Pomeroy, pointed a gun at two men and called them the N-word at this Sitco gas station in Detroit in July of 2013. Photos show Pomeroy and Notoriano at the scene, both off duty at the time. The men they confronted allegedly stole Notoriano's 16-year-old daughter's cell phone. Only the misdemeanor charge stuck. Notori Toriano's attorney claimed his client's actions nearly three years ago were out of character. Judge, he's not the same man that he was on July 21st, 2013. But when the prosecutors found racial slurs by Notoriano in text messages on his phone, Judge Kenny said being prejudiced is, in fact, part of who Notoriano is, sentencing him to jail over probation. Reporting from Frank Murphy, Hall of Justice, Lauren Podell, Local 4. Notoriano's co-defendant David Pomeroy let, pled guilty last year to the failure to uphold the law. He was sentenced last September to nine months non-reporting probation. Both officers have been fired.